Hello guys, Matthew here from UChat. So in today's video, I'm going to share the new update from UChat, which is a native WooCommerce integration. Okay, so we will talk about the features of this integration, and also we will walk through the actions and the triggers supported, and also I will show you a quick demo of the WooCommerce native integration. Okay, so first of all, let's talk about the features. Okay, so our WooCommerce integrations. Previously, we have the WooCommerce mini app. Okay. But since this is a large e commerce platform, we are going to uh, have a native integration so that you will now find the WooCommerce integration in the integration tab. Okay. And also, you will find the WooCommerce in the action and the integrations. Okay. We will we support a lot of actions and the triggers, which I will cover very soon. So the most important features is with this WooCommerce integration, it directly integrates integrate with WooCommerce API. Okay, that means you do not need to sync the product into our built-in e-commerce. We directly get all the data information from your WooCommerce site. Okay, that will always keep the information um real time on real time okay for example if you have the product that is out of stock they will not show up in the bot okay whatever change you make at your store it will you know in real time reflect in your chatbot as well another thing is you can um generate the checkout page in woocommerce using woocommerce checkout okay that means the order generated in the chatbot will be synced. Uh, they will, you know, they will generate in your WooCommerce uh, website, okay, directly. So that will consolidate all the order in one place. Even the order is coming from the chatbot, the social channels. And the third point is it supports this integration support in all the channels we support, okay. And also you can use this integration for the marketing, for the custom support. There are many user cases for that. Okay, so that is the features and the actions and the triggers. So let me show you the actions and the triggers we have for the WooCommerce integration. And after that, I will show you a quick demo. So if you go to the, um, the integration, okay, first of all, let me show you the integration. You go to the integration, you will find the WooCommerce. Uh, follow the subscription, you know, descriptions of here, put your API keys and everything, and then you will connect it. Okay. And the triggers we have, let me first show you the triggers we have. The triggers is you know, you need to go to the automation, go to the triggers, and then you will see we have two triggers. Okay. Uh, we have one trigger. Okay. That is WooCommerce webhook. But, and this Webhook trigger, we have two events type. That is order created or order updated. Okay. Order created is when you generate a checkout link. So you can use this to set up the abandoned card follow up. And also order update when, when, you know, when you complete the order, when you ship the order, you can trigger the information in the bot send it to your customers. Okay. So that is the triggers. So what kind of the actions we have? So let me show you. Okay, if you go to uh, any of the flow, okay, I go to integration and then go to WooCommerce, and then you will see here is all the actions we support. Okay, uh, you can add card, remove from card, empty the card, or get the card items, or you can create order from the card. You can search for the coupons, you can create the coupons, you can update or delete coupons. For the customers, it, this, you can search for the customers, get customer information, create customer update and delete customer. Okay. You can search for the orders, you can get all the information, uh, you can update, delete, create all the notes. Okay. For the products is you can search for the products, you can get product information, you can create product or you can, you know, search for product app variant, get product variant, list all the products and list all the search for the product categories. Okay. And uh, yeah, so basically we tied up all the WooCommerce API endpoints over here. 
and you can do whatever you want and you can offer the hub you can you can offer the uh, customer support you can do the marketing and you can ask for the reviews you can even create the product in woocommerce and then generate a checkout page that the customer pays in your woocommerce okay so that is the actions and the triggers we support now let me show you a quick demo and i will i will explain in this demo okay so let me share my screens over here So first of all, um, let me go to the demo page. I will type the keywords and then the trigger the demo. Okay, here is welcome to the WooCommerce demo shop. And you can start shopping. And then this will dynamically pull all the collections you have at your WooCommerce store. Okay, so you can see I have three collections and I can click any of these collections, okay? And then it, it will display all the products and that collection. And remember this will cover the single product and also the product with the variant, okay? For example, this gene, if you want to learn more, you can click this, it will redirect you to your WooCommerce website, okay? So you can check more about the product if you want, okay? If you are happy with that, you can click add to the cart. This is a, this is a simple product. It doesn't have the variant, okay? As you can see, this product already added to the cart. And also we support the variant product. For example, these shoes, if you click add to cart, because this product have the variant, it will actually pull all the variant for this product. You can see there is a red color, green color, and blue color. And I like the blue color, so I will choose this one. You can add to cart. And now you have two products add to the cart, okay? You can remove the product from the cart, okay? If you remove, from, pro, remove the product from the cart, and now you can only have one product in the cart, okay? Imagine now if you want to check out. So you can click confirm, and we will ask you in the bot for the email, phone number, or, you know, shipping address if you want. So I will update the emails and also I will update my shipping address. And now it will generate a WooCommerce checkout link, okay? So it, it will ask you to confirm the information and I will confirm now it will generate a checkout link for you. Okay, this is a WooCommerce checkout. And also over here, you can set up the abandoned cart, abandoned cart follow-ups, okay? So I click this, it will redirect me to the checkout page on WooCommerce, okay? Uh, because you already collected the user information, so you do not need, to, they do not need to type the information again on the checkout page. So imagine that I want to pay now, so you can pay for the order. And after payment, you will redirect to the thank you page and you will also receive the order confirmation in the chatbot, okay? Uh, this will take some while because uh, WooCommerce uh, webhook is not instant. It take uh, 10 to 15 seconds, something like that but you will able to receive the order information in the bot, okay? I will check up this later. And also now I will go to the shops of the WooCommerce store and I will see, let you see that the order just generated, okay? So now, uh, as you can see in the bot, we already received the information from the WooCommerce, okay? That is, thank you for your order. All the 4513 is currently in processing. We will update soon. And also another message is your order is completed. And let me see this order in the desktop. Okay. So if you log in your WooCommerce account, you go to the orders. You go to the orders. Okay. You can see this 4513, this order just generated. Okay. And also you can see uh, currently the order is already completed 
uh, you can see the billing, the URLs, the emails. If you're asking for the phone number and the name, it will also show up in all the details. Okay. And whatever change you make over here, it will trigger, it will send this trigger information into your chat. Okay. Imagine that when you ship the product, you have the tracking number, you put the um, tracking number in the order and you change the status and then it will automatically trigger an information you want and send it to the customers. Okay. So that is um, the whole demos of this WooCommerce integration. It's very short and we will very soon, we will bring the templates and the training videos for this WooCommerce integration. Okay. And a couple of the user case is you can use this, you know, imagine that you can combine this with Facebook and or Instagram comment growth tools for marketing. For example, you can have some discount for a particular product. If the user comments and the bots, the messenger or Instagram bots will pick up the conversation and then we'll show the product and then we'll apply the coupon code and then generate the, generate the um, checkout link. And when they finish the payment, the order will be in your WooCommerce store. And also the user will receive instant um, confirmation in the bot as well. Okay. And you can keep engaged with them across all the social channels we support. Okay. And also another user case is because we have the web chat, right? So you can easily integrate this as the support, custom support. Okay. You can ask for the users email and then you can search for the customer and then you can search for the orders and then you can pull the order status for them okay so that will help you increase the support efficiency and keep your customers happy and also the third part is you can sell on all the social channels we support okay and you can directly you know pull the data from your woocommerce generate the checkout links and all the orders will consolidate into your WooCommerce. Okay. You can set up all your automations in your chat, you know, in SMS and emails. That's very easy to do. And that is very short videos I'm going to show you today. And please stay tuned for our coming templates and the training videos for the WooCommerce integration. See you guys in the next video. Bye.